recorded live in Austin, Texas, USA. It's the William Montgomery Show. Starring William Montgomery and the devious Casey Rocket. With the Tony Chin Orchestra. The William Montgomery Jr. Dancers. As always, William is joined by the lovely Erica. I'm Casey Rocket. And now here he is, the big red machine, the Memphis Strangler, William Montgomery. So, uh, I don't know, you can keep that if you want, or you can restart. Well, now he's going to fucking charge us for another hour. That's mm-hmm. what he does. We go a minute over, he charges us for an- Are you really going to do that today on Halloween to us, Grant? Meters Are run. you really trying to throw us off right now? <laughs> Just charge him for another restart, Grant. Just going to charge you for another restart. You're charging us for another restart. Do y'all realize how much a restart? What is a it's restart these the cost days? Well, it's, yeah, it's one point yeah. five the cost. So I think what would that be? You're Six really grand? doing one point yeah. five the cost, Grant? <laughs> yeah, just on for Halloween restart. for a restart. Did yeah. you say six grand or six grant? Six grand. <laughs> no, <laughs> yeah, the value of his life, and it's basically yeah. whatever we assess that it is. It's yeah, today changing. it's not so high. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> today it's kind of low. About Twenty bucks. About Twenty damn bucks for your head, Grant. Yeah, Grant, you can't even get shit at McDonald's these days for 20 days. 20 days. 20 days. (laughs) Wait, what? It'll be one day. That's when the best part is that we we discovered P. Terry's while we're out here. Dude, get a Mm. meal. Get a meal for 1088. Yeah, P. Terry's is really good. And I, if I could recommend, get the veggie patty with a burger patty. Dude. God, don't! Yes, God damn dude. it, dude! I told you that's a thing. He was gonna. It's a thing. He, yeah, he said that he refrained the other night from ordering the double cheese with a chicken patty on it as well. Well, that was an Ooh. option on the app, on like the <laughs> app, and I was like, I would never do that in front of someone, you know? <laughs> like that's like something you would hide from everybody. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> so did you get it? Did it come? No, with the I did. I didn't get it like that. I just got the regular double. He's. Cool. I think we're gonna go after this, and he's gonna do it if I'm not no, looking. I'm, I'm, what do you mean if you're not looking? <laughs> like if I agree to sit at a different table, I think I'll do it. <laughs> that would be so awkward. <laughs> Just peek over at it. Like, don't look at it. You start spitting out chicken. <laughs> <laughs> don't look at it. Damn, they got that secret menu. William, when's the last time you used a secret menu at Pete Terry's? They have a secret menu. Oh yeah. Yeah. Oh my yeah. god. Oh my god. We gotta mm-hmm. unlock that. Brownies, ice cream. Yeah, milk slap. What? Milk uh, slap. Are you just saying you're t- you're just saying two words no. you think of right now? It's <laughs> yeah. Milk slap. It's, I think it's a Wisconsin thing yeah. or something. Yeah, milk it's a slap. cheese curd covered in uh, Dove chocolate. Yeah. <laughs> so, <I'm just> really <laughs> good. Start doing it around this time of year. Better than it seems. Yeah. We we'll need a milk slap. <laughs> yeah, that's. I'm gonna go in there and get arrested. Can I get two milk slaps, sir? <laughs> Step to the side. Yeah. Stay right there. <laughs> 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 Double gun. <laughs> yeah, hold on. It kind of. Yeah, what if these were guns? Milk slap. <laughs> All right. I, I told you. No, Grant just mocked that up really, really fast in Photoshop. I know what's going on here, dude. No. Yeah, That's Green's weird. gotten really good. He had a lot of time. He was at the hospital a bunch, I think, <laughs> dealing with his family stuff. So he was able to. He's gotten really good at this. What? Past month or something. Mm, he's got a, really a lot good. of time on his hands. How long have you guys been doing it? A month. Six months. <laughs> 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 been about a month ago. Hell yeah. You can tell the difference, though. Yeah. He's learning. Yeah. Uh, well, Zach and Kenny, thank y'all so much for being on the show today. This Halloween special. It's a special part of the year. It's a special time of the year. It's a spooky time of the year. It's a it's a cold time of the year here right now, very which cool. is very fun. It's very odd. It's very it's perfect for Halloween. Yeah, we we experienced cold uh, on Saturday night that I will not experience during the whole winter in Southern California. So I got my fill. Ooh, was it raining? It was raining, and it was like literally like forty three degrees, and it was like it was my hands were cold for the first time. <laughs> Since I've been here in like 2008, so damn. The last time you flew on the plane, yeah. Last time I flew on the plane was to come here to visit a friend. Come to what well, was it, Dallas area? Damn. Cold damn. hands. Do you fly on planes? Oh me? Uh, <laughs> 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 I, 
<laughs> us thinking about stuff. Here we go. Uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that's just <be> good, dude. <laughs> uh, yeah, no, I fly on planes a lot. <laughs> They're scarier. You used to them? See what I fly on them some now, and they, they used to scare the shit out of me. Now it's a little better. Yeah, it used to scare the shit out of me too. Now I'm just like super, it's just super normal. Uh, so I don't know. I'm not stoked on, turb- on like turbulence though. Like when it drops and stuff. Had a lot of that coming here. William, uh, tell how you were holding hands with those women. Tell that story. <laughs> oh my gosh. Yeah. And uh, I was, when I was still living in LA, I was back in Memphis for Christmas time. And then I'm flying back to LA. And we hit this horrible turbulence. I was telling Casey it was like what we experienced, but a number of times. And I was sitting next to these uh, just two nice black girls, and we all just ended up holding hands. It was that scary. I Jesus. swear to God. Yeah, that's, <laughs> that's my nightmare. The only thing that will give me solace if that starts happening is that you guys are all talking about it. So I'm like, this is normal. This is normal. And then I hope there's some black girls around her. I'm going to be <laughs> in trouble. <laughs> The yeah, I don't know why I had to say black girl, but yeah, there were the girls right there, and it helped being able to hold hands. Were those the first black hands you ever held? <laughs> yeah, well, there was this lady named Emma Jean who used to clean up my parents' house sometimes, and oh, I was she uh, a slave. <laughs> Jesus Christ, <laughs> Emma Jean, come in here, Emma Jean. <laughs> oh my gosh! One day we she had a gold tooth, and we were looking for her gold tooth. It was missing one day, You're and to I. Sell it? <laughs> And I swear to God, we're looking for Imogene's gold tooth one day. I wasn't. I was a little boy. But we end up going to my brother Vance's crib, and he smiles, and he has, like, this gold tooth smile. He had had it in his mouth. He had denture things in her mouth. As a tiny little boy. <laughs> he popped it over his own stinky tooth. He popped it off. Yeah, I think it was. Smart kid. There was like a number of teeth. I think it wasn't just a cold tooth. Oh, Grant. Really oh, was good, grills? man. She yeah. lost her grills. <laughs> what? Yeah, Grant, listen and to the God, story. And then, why did he wa- and then why did he want to go, Emma Jean, let me borrow your tooth. I need to eat this burger. No, he was just probably, I don't know, two or three years old, just in the crib, just a tiny little baby boy. And I guess they had fallen out in his crib. <laughs> what was she doing with her teeth in his crib? I don't know. I don't know. Yeah, I haven't thought. I think you would notice if your teeth fell out. Your teeth were just falling out all around the house. <laughs> uh, it would yeah. be like when you lose your keys. Where did you last notice you had your teeth? <laughs> yeah. I don't know. And then she vomited all on the walls one night. <laughs> all on the walls. What's wrong with her? She Maybe you guys should awesome. paint her. I know, yeah. She, she was living badass. in the <laughs> attic. She, yeah, maybe, I don't know. That's the whole thing I got to take up with my parents at some time. I mean, I have a lot of uh, kind of trauma. I don't know. I mean, yeah, you could call it trauma probably. I have a lot to unpack there. I have a lot to say to Larry and Francis next time I fucking see them. And you can bet, you can bet the farm that I'm going to bring it up. You gonna see him on th- you gonna see him on Thanksgiving? No, maybe Christmas though. No. Yeah. That's always a hard conversation to have. Is, you know, what was that maid really getting into? <laughs> <laughs> was, was she puking so much? And yeah, <laughs> what happened? That day with losing her gold teeth. Yeah. <laughs> like William, that maid burned down thirty-five years ago tonight. You saw her. <laughs> <laughs> It's like a Tyler Durden situation. I think there is no no maid. We never had a maid. Are you? (laughs) What are you talking about, William? Yeah, who's Imogene? What are you you bringing this up? We're so scared. (laughs) That was William's alter ego. Imogene. Imogene. (laughs) A black slave from the 1800s. You've been in an accident, William. Wake up. He's been trying to reach you Just for wake 10 years. Up. He wakes up, he's like, oh, I'm Emma Jean. The skeleton key to Emma Jean's revenge. Yeah. The teeth were mine. Yeah. Are you guys it's like, like 2076? <laughs> yeah. I don't know. The resistance needs your help. Yeah. We've been waiting for you. Emma Jean, future slave. God damn it. <laughs> And I come out with this fucking, 
what Tinky Winky thing? I don't know. I mean, <laughs> yeah, he's just, just like this. <laughs> yeah, mine's kind of just down. I got, <laughs> when it was all like translucent or <laughs> I'm kind of just cool. <laughs> yeah, they need us. We show up, Casey. <laughs> just like, like uh, well, what can we do to be of assistance? Are, are you guys Halloween guys? Like, is that your thing? Oh, or, or ladies? Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. It's mm. always been my thing. What's been your best costume of all time? Well, I've the fondest memories of being with my old friend Diller Butler, and I was Batman, and he was Robin, and we got the uh, the capes were made out of towels. What? That was a classic. Every name in your Rolodex sounds fake. <laughs> Diller Butler. Diller. I think he's the third as well. I use his. Uh, YouTube TV account. He's very gracious and lets me use, lets me use his YouTube TV account. So I say every time when I turn on the TV, "Welcome, Dillard." I that's think, well, yeah, that's how do you spell friend. that? Uh, D i l l a r d. Dillard. Oh, I didn't hear the D. I got you now. Dillard. I'm glad I asked for the spelling. Welcome, Dillard. Access granted. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Vizio. <laughs> Pull up top five scariest sharks of 2019. <laughs> Dude, Teletubbies was ahead of its time. I didn't realize there was a person of color. <laughs> I Did you guys remember? Did you guys know that? Oh, my gosh. Yeah, uh, the green know. one. Mandela uh, effect. So crazy. Yeah. that's No, I don't remember that. He made the least of money, the green one. <laughs> but he had those beautiful eyes. Very pretty eyes. Um, <laughs> okay, William. <laughs> we know which one you'd fuck. <laughs> the green one with his, his thing sticking straight up. <laughs> he's got those light eyes, so he's either mixed or Puerto Rican. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Don't know there's Puerto Rican teletubby. <laughs> yeah. Well, I can't see his belly completely. Was it a flag? Oh. I don't know. The big island. <laughs> no, it's not Puerto Rico. Yeah, yeah. Oh, That's a gag I do. You're a Jamaican in Hawaii? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Isn't there only... Wait, I don't, I mean, maybe I'm an idiot. Is there more than one Jamaican island? Yeah, hold on. Yeah, the so the big island mm -hmm. is Hawaii. Yeah, what is... <laughs> uh, what is... I don't know what they call Jamaica. Um, yeah, the Big Island. Yeah, like, Kingston. Yeah, Kingston <laughs> Town. The, uh, the Black Island? <laughs> it could, I don't know. Yeah, the Big Island. Well, I need to work on that. I'm doing it for like a month now. <laughs> we'll get to the bottom of it. Ooh. Well, let's go around the room and say the scariest thing you've seen all week. Oh. If it's a ghost, if it, if it is anyone seen a ghost or... Yeah, Kenny, mm -hmm. have you seen, what's your, like, especially scary, I mean, it's Halloween time, it's Halloween day today, the spirits are out in full force. This week, I don't think I've seen anything scary, right. I'm trying to think if I, like, specifically this week, but uh, I think the scariest, I'll say the scariest things uh, are when you wake up in the middle of the night and you think you see something in your room. And then you're you're certain like there is somebody in here. Then you turn the light on, and it's like something that's been in your room for seven years. Like yeah, like can. when, when yeah. yeah when it's like a you think it's a man, and it's just like a chair or a pile of clothes. Yeah, like there's nothing scarier than waking up to that. It's a cut out of Jeff Gordon. Yeah, yeah, that would be yeah, scary. Scary. I, I always <laughs> just take all my cardboard <laughs> cutouts around my room <laughs> for real people. <laughs> yeah, he died. Hamas yeah. killed Jeff Gordon. A lot of people don't. Recipes, Jeff Gordon. Yeah, during that music festival. Yeah, we need to get the word out. It's like, <laughs> yeah, you know, they Jeff Gordon was at that music festival in Israel, and Hamas got him. So. He was hosting. Yeah, he was a great host. He was really good with people. He always loved people. He loved kids. He was. He would have glow sticks. He would have smoke machines. He'd come from a cloud of smoke when he would get up on stage with Number his glow 24. sticks. Yeah, with twenty-four Jeff all over Gordon. the place. The number one in our hearts. Yes, DJ Twenty Four, rest in peace. Uh. But yeah, we're just trying to get the word out on that. I mean, it's a hairy situation over there, obviously, but just trying to get the word out. <laughs> and Grant, I, Grant's <laughs> Jewish. Grant, what are what are your thoughts on all this? About Jeff Gordon? Yeah. yeah. We'll start there and see where it goes. I mean, he, he was the best of us. <laughs> he was the best of us. He was the worst of us. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I mean, he's no Tony Stewart, you know? No. Yeah, what is that, Home Depot? 
Is yeah. his main sponsor? Yeah. And yeah, then he's just out. Tony Stewart's just like outspoken. I think he's the one that like threw his helmet at like a move at another NASCAR. He threw his <laughs> helmet when he got in a wreck and shit. Yeah, you can't do that on the NASCAR. You mm-hmm. can't do that. I know what's scary from this week. When we were going home from Terry Black's, we took an Uber. That was a 20 minute Uber. And we had a crazy Uber driver that told us a story. Oh my God, <laughs> dude. That guy was insane. We oh, so he literally goes, Oh, oh it's God. gonna take twenty minutes to get you there. I got a story for you of something that happened to me last <laughs> week. Yeah. Weird. And then to not make this a long, drawn out, boring story, this- I'll just give you the quick notes of it. He found out he had a an ex wife, and then someone like from like twenty years ago. He's going to do a random pickup too for Uber. Yeah, yeah. and he picks someone up, and he's like, "Man, it just really looks like my ex wife, but when she was young." When she was young, and then the girl goes, "Do you not recognize me? Do I look familiar to you? Do I look like someone from your past." And it ended up being <laughs> That's what she said. It, what? It, it ended up being a, a daughter that he never knew. Holy and then he's shit. like, "And then he's like, how'd you get in my car?" And he was like, "Well, you know, Aunt Gina and Uncle Tom." You know how they work, went to MIT, but we hacked all of your devices. Yeah, they've been teaching been... me how to hack all these years. <laughs> yeah, yeah. And, <laughs> and, and we've been watching you. And we've been watching you for months on all of your uh, devices. No. So, <laughs> Yikes. And, we, and, and then I can't help myself, so I'm in the back seat going, like, Dude, she's watching you in the bathroom? And he's like, that's what I said. <laughs> and he's like, and I do some nasty stuff in there. And that's she's like, funny. yeah, we even see the stuff in the bathroom. It was just <laughs> why do you need to see that part? Don't I, don't, need to. I don't even know why that yeah. part was in the story. Dude. Yeah. Like, yeah. <laughs> and what can they access like the camera on your phone? That's what he's saying. Every- like, he's like everything. Yeah. He, he's like, I have one of the, he kept calling Alexa Alexis. Yeah. He's, he's like, I have that Alexis at home. I have the Alexis, and they, they tapped into my Alexis and they <laughs> and they got my phone and my smart TV. To what end? <laughs> Why yeah. Yeah. Yeah, to torture uh, <laughs> No, to, to monitor him so she could decide when to like <laughs> Bring it on him at the right time. Yeah, <laughs> when to call the Uber to get him to pick his ass <laughs> up. The long and con. Like, and then yeah. she's been putting. Uh, <laughs> oh she's been, yeah, she's been putting videos in his YouTube playlist. What? <laughs> <laughs> and she Gosh. Put, and he's like, she's been putting all these like really deep songs, like that song by Black Eyed Peas, "Where's the Love," <laughs> and like all this stuff. Let's get it started. <laughs> so, yeah. he's, he's like songs only. Uh, Songs only a daughter would would put to her father, like "Where is the love?" And I, and I literally Gosh. was like, "Wait, the Black Eyed Peas song?" He's like, "Yeah, that one, dude." <laughs> wow, down with the sickness. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> um, but yeah, what else? What did? What else did he say? Even like, he's like, he's like mad at them. He still doesn't want to accept like the yeah, because he hates his ex wife, and his ex wife ended up everybody found out that she was doing porn site for ten years. Like yeah. it just. <laughs> This guy's just a compulsive liar. Pornside.com. The guy's got a <laughs> <laughs> Pornside.org. <laughs> One of the sexiest domains. Pornside.gov. Yeah, Pornside. 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 <laughs> yeah <exactly. laughs> Fucking ridiculous. Yeah, it was just a while. It was, it was too much, dude. Yeah. Oh, you think he was making all of it up? I ha- no. oh, who dude, has the- somebody? I know. If you have everything, you could just no. send him a call or an email. Yeah, yeah. 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 Not order they some were- fake Uber and like <laughs> recognize me. That's not a thing. Yeah, <laughs> but when he told me that, when he said that they, he, the their family members have been teaching her how to hack for years, I was like, <laughs> what, dude? Like, they went to MIT, yeah. so they've been teaching her how to hack, and like, I was just like, what? <laughs> just like hacking into the mainframe of everything? Everything. Yeah, uh, it, had, it had to have been been a, a lie. No, but then when I got out of the car, he's like, so what would you do in this situation? And I was just like, fuck, dude, like, I don't know, like, hopefully, you'll probably see her again. <laughs> like, <laughs> when she's ready, she'll yeah. see you. She'll find you. He's like, I don't know how to process this. He had a little dog in the car in the passenger in the passenger. I don't think seat. the dog was real. <laughs> and he just like held it up to our faces. He's like, This is my dog. I, I don't remember the name, but it looked fake almost. Did it, move it, was, it, was, it <laughs> moved a little bit, it was but barking. like slightly animatronic, you know. <laughs> did y'all end up tipping the guy at all? Uh, did no, I get the Uber? No, I got the Uber. I did not. T- that's when I. That's yeah. when I was like, man, these Ubers are gonna be. Cost- I realized how much we're gonna be spending on Ubers. Those first oh, three yeah. Uber drivers got some good tips, and I'm like, damn, we're Ubering a lot, and these tips are gonna really add up. And so I was yeah. like, uh, we'll skip that. I wanted yeah. to like 
contact him again somehow and like just have, do a podcast with him. Yeah, I was hoping that he would. <laughs> yeah. I, I kind of am hoping that he picks us up one of these Ubers that we take. So, but I think he's gone. I think he's like gone in the wind. Just <laughs> <laughs> what recognize me from your past? It's him. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. It's oh, like, oh no, shit. he's probably got our phones hacked right now. <laughs> yeah, yeah. That's what I was saying. I was like, They're she's listening probably, to all of us. <laughs> like, uh. She's just texting dad, please quit telling the story to every passenger. <laughs> 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 the dog. <laughs> the dog. <laughs> Did it look anything like that? Was it big? No, it was, like it, a, it was it, a little almost like Pomeranian. Looked like, kind of like a little tiny bear. Like and it was white. <laughs> you shoved it in your face. This is a real dog. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry, I didn't trust me. <laughs> Talk straight into its mouth. <laughs> <laughs> Tell it your secrets. <laughs> yeah. <Don't> tell anyone. <laughs> this, it's a, this is a signal jammer, so they can't look at my phone anymore. <laughs> <laughs> oh, then he was like saying that he would yell like every when he gets mad, he yells at the phone, and he yells at all of his devices because so his daughter can hear. <laughs> Gosh, he's like, no, listen to me. Crazy. And he's I like, wonder I, if he even, if he even has a daughter. I, he, I don't know. That that is real. And he, he said he yells that he wants to kill his ex wife, and I'm like, dude, you can't he's say like, that when they're listening he's like, to they, you. Yeah, it's like they all know yeah. I'm gonna chop her up into pieces. <laughs> yeah, and, yeah, hundred percent. That's 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 a, that's a William. That's a direct quote. <laughs> yeah, direct. <laughs> chop her up into pieces. <laughs> that was scary. But like, you're implicating us in this crime now, sir. Well, and then he was like, he's like, I went to go get my stuff after the divorce and I showed him she was fat, but it turns out she was pregnant. And then he was just like making fun of her and for being like, fat. He's like, like I told her, he's like, I told her she was fat. I was like, look at you. you that was like a me. five minute part of the story. Yeah. And I was like, <laughs> <laughs> look at you. You needed me. You got fat. <laughs> and then he's like, the daughter brought that up. You remember when you told mom she got fat? That was just me. Yeah. <laughs> that was me hacking in her belly. <laughs> she she ate a MacBook Pro, so I could hack. <laughs> uh, uh, fuck. I love the idea of some secret familial John Wick style <laughs> academy of hackers. <laughs> Just using their powers for such monotonous things. <laughs> and why, why would they teach her how to hack instead of just hacking it themselves? And by the way, this is your dad. <laughs> yeah, and then just be like, here, meet him at the corner of this and that. Yeah. Yikes. Well, that's Austin, that's Austin for you. <laughs> I guess that's, what, yeah. that's showbiz, brother. <laughs> just used to it. Such a weird Uber drive. I feel like the past couple I've had, they can't. You can't talk to him because they say they have a sign that say, "Don't talk, I'm deaf." And so that's always <laughs> don't talk. <laughs> Not only I can't hear you, but please don't even speak at all. <laughs> yeah, yeah, don't even try. So it makes me feel uncomfortable if someone talks in my car. <laughs> yeah. um, another oh, another scary thing is uh, we ate Long John Silver's yesterday. Yeah, that was scary for for lunch. If you guys have any oh of you, oh my guys, gosh, where was it? We lit. We used to live by one, but it closed down recently. Dying to try it. Oh man, I don't recommend it. <laughs> it I, was, we it, both it, wanted it for nostalgia because I, yeah. like I said, I was born here. I lived here. I lived like in Coppers Cove, Texas, till I was ten, and, and moved to California. And there was a Long John Silver's there, and I remember loving it. Yeah, I grew up in Indiana, and there was tons of Long John Silver's around. And we oh. went yesterday, and we were both like, "Yeah, this is." good as we were eating it and then honestly for about tw about 20 minutes later and then for the rest of the day we were both just like dude i'm not right i'm just <laughs> not right what did y'all have fish or yeah, what fish did uh, yeah it was like a fish and chicken combo no, i nice. ordered a crab cake they got very mad that i ordered they were like no <laughs> they were like <sighs> i got they were so mad that we ate inside the restaurant there's no one else there yeah it was early he was, uh, the, the, the guy at the register was just like Okay, you can eat here, and then yeah. <laughs> got his it's blessing. Like, yeah, you're the yeah. one that asked for here to go, <laughs> and then was and then he like was upset. And it was like this is like at noon. This is not we're not like we're not last minute guys. That's bullshit. I was always more of a Captain D's guy. Did y'all ever have Captain D's? Oh, Captain D's. No. No. Yeah, that was the one in Memphis. That was the one in Tennessee. So. Yeah. Captain D's. Same type of shit. Those <laughs> fish and chips. Exact same. Mm -hmm. Hell yeah. They just don't have, it's just, the fish, honestly, was way better than the shrimp. I wish I would have only ate the fish. The fish was actually, I, like, not terrible, but it's just, uh, I don't know, man. The grease they use really just sits in your gut. Yeah. Long John Silvers. Ugh. 
That's long, John. Be but, careful. Oh my gosh, hold on. Do y'all like Chipotle style burritos? Yes. Yes. Yeah. Go okay. to uh, Cabo Bob's. <laughs> Great. Cabo Bob's. Highly Cabo Bob's. recommend it's very Cabo good. Bob's. Yeah. I love Cabo they Bob's. They make your little stinky tortilla right in front of you. Tss, tss. Oh, oh, another from, nice. from scratch? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Ooh, that does sound bomb. It's green, wonderful. Red, and yeah, green, red, and orange. So are tortillas? they different flavors, or is it just you get to look at the color? Cheese so tortilla. Like, Ancho. Spinach. Damn, I gotta check this out. I do really. I like a uh, homemade tortilla is always bomb as fuck. Mm -hmm. Yeah, Cabo Bob. It's very good. We love it. We're looking for a sponsorship. Uh, as locals, as locals, do you guys eat at Terry Black's very often? No, not really. No, I've mm -hmm. been there once, maybe or twice. It's really good. I enjoyed it, but all the barbecue. I love the barbecue, but it just seems I don't know. Very filling. It seems like it's very sodium heavy, and I already I've been fucking eating the sweets recently. I had half of a cake last night. <laughs> Hell yeah! <laughs> oh. Well, how big was the cake? Because that strawberry. The strawberry size of a strawberry. That's very reasonable. reasonable. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> sounds like one bite. Okay. Sounds <laughs> reasonable. It sounds like you're doing well. Dude. Yeah. <laughs> sounds like you can splurge on some barbecue if you wanted to. <laughs> He's been eating a bunch of those uh, chocolate covered Ritz. Holy oh, shit. Oh, dude. Dude. We made some of those in the store. Are they yeah. good? Oh my gosh. <laughs> yeah. They're I wonderful. I shouldn't have those. <laughs> Don't. Because a Ritz, I can eat a sleeve or two of Ritz. I yeah. love just a Ritz, but holy shit, with the chocolate yeah. on it, it takes it to a whole nother level. Ritz, Ritz <laughs> is like. Sorry, You're I'm still like going. putting the chips in a dip, too. <laughs> 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 yeah, Ritz is like the Pringles of crackers. You gotta eat just the whole. Like, oh, you just oh, eat man. the whole thing, dude. Oh yeah. Oh my gosh. But yeah, chocolate covered Ritz. Highly <laughs> recommend. Yeah. Ritz are actually kind of sweet. Like they're like, they're almost a sweet cracker as is. Like a raw like a raw Ritz is a little tiny bit a sweet. Raw Ritz. <laughs> <laughs> well, now there's, raw? well now well oh, now we have like... these. So now the original is raw Ritz. I don't I don't know raw about that. Ritz energy. Yeah, are you buying that the raw Ritz? Yeah, I, the raw? I mean, I I definitely I'm definitely a fan of the raw. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, love the raw. Raw dog grits. We have yeah, a, raw dog grits. We got a back box of those back at the room, just the regular ones. Shit. Ooh. To eat some with some top ramen. Might have to stop Don't. by with my boys. <laughs> <laughs> Get some damn Ritz in there. <laughs> Visitor. <laughs> Let us know, dude. We can arrange yeah, it. Yeah, yeah. We I got, got a, you. I got a sleeve for you, dude. Damn. <laughs> Crush it up, put it under the covers in the bed, fucking yeah. land in a little bit. It's to be bad. <laughs> oh, yeah. Uh, eat, eat them all fucking horizontal. <laughs> Yeah, the crumbs, that's always a bad deal with the reds. Mm -hmm. You get really yeah. crummy. Put a couple in your mouth, you can't chew them all, they start coming out of your mouth a little bit. <laughs> it's coming out everywhere. Yeah. It's not good. I mean, just eat one at a time, though. Yeah, I know, but brother. they're so good. I'm playing yeah. Diablo. You gotta, like, double them, the triple. <laughs> yeah. Searching quadruples. Ooh, <laughs> making my sorcerer stronger. I'm eating these Ritz faster and faster. Are you drinking anything with the chocolate Ritz? Um, uh, water a decent amount. No uh, magnesium. Are they also yeah. in a sleeve like the chocolate ones? No, they're in this plastic container. And oh, you take you, the plastic wrapping yeah. off, and then they just there's not even it's easy access. <laughs> okay, I was thinking it was yeah. like a Girl Scout cookie like sleeve. <laughs> <laughs> no, that would be good. It's not. No, it's more an like an Oreo. Yeah. Not okay. It's they, Oreo adjacent. Do they do? Do they do Girl Scouts out here? Yeah, there's some of them. Weird yeah. Russian ask. <laughs> <laughs> it's Texas. They might just be like, <laughs> I don't know. I just <laughs> yeah. They have, have Girl Scouts, no Boy Scouts, which is kind of weird. But they do have the Girl Scouts here. Oh, that's odd. I would have thought it'd be backwards. Yeah, they no Boy Scouts. I think they ran Dude, out. milk slabs yeah. and the chocolate. <laughs> oh my god! Ooh. Dinner of kings. Dude. You dip a milk slap in the Ritz, so yes. nothing really yeah. gets on it. <laughs> yes. Yes. Yeah, you're, dip. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. you're just touching them together before yeah. you eat them for no reason. 
Damn it. Now I want to try the goddamn Ritz. And I was making, I, we were literally making fun of them in the store. That's I mean, we've been seeing a bunch of people That's talk so about it. funny. Be yeah. careful. Oh, are people talking? Well, they're yeah. so. Yeah, the streets are talking right yeah. now. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the streets are talking. Honestly, the streets are talking. We dude. started out on the wrong side of history. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> well, y'all try them and get back to me, but I think, yeah. I trust y'all will like them. I, I, without a doubt, will like them. <laughs> Yeah, they're good. We're straight to Walmart after He's this. He's going to read a book really quick. <laughs> yeah. You guys are yeah. fucking boring. <laughs> <laughs> I'm done with this shit. <laughs> yeah. He's, He's like, we're, pay- <laughs> we're paying for this time. I'm going to use it wisely. <laughs> Casey, what, uh, what would you say even the temperature outside is today? It's got to be borderline chilly. Me and all my friends, we've been wearing coats. It's so freezing. Yeah, it's really cold, and w- a weird thing that I actually recently discovered is the uh, more pubic hair you have, the colder you get down there. So you actually want to keep it really trimmed down there, and then you stay warmer down there, which is actually counterintuitive, Casey, but that's what the science is <laughs> figuring out these days. I saw that article in Vanity Fair, but yes. nobody wants to be the guy who lets his ball hair grow as wild as the forests of the Pacific Northwest. Yeah, I mean, that gets wild up there. They have giant trees. They have ferns. They have all kinds of stuff. But luckily now with Manscaped, a wonderful company called Manscaped, they've launched the fifth the fifth generation performance package, Casey. Got them up. As if you thought it couldn't get any better. Spoiler alert, it actually does. Yeah, they have something called the Lawn Mower 5.0 Ultra, K Ultra? <laughs> Yeah, I think I'm hearing that right, but something's not computing. It sounds like too good of a deal. Yeah, I can't even believe this. When you're going for a close shave below the belt, you want the best of the best. Yeah, the new trimmer features two interchangeable blade heads. One is for taking a little bit off the top, and the other is a new foil blade for a smooth, close shave. The foil blade. (laughs) (laughs) <laughs> but yeah, with three length setting combos and waterproofing, you can get any look anywhere, even on that big island. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, you're telling me I can get this thing on the big island? You can get this thing on the big island. <laughs> Well, as always, Manscaped Skin Safe Technology prevents nicks, snags, and tugs. And you always look and feel your best with the Manscaped Performance Package. Which is what we need around this time of year. Get 20% off and free shipping with the code WMS at manscaped.com. That's 20% that's off. off and free, and shipping. free shipping with the code WMS at manscaped.com. <laughs> Your balls have been through enough. It's It's time time to to go go ultra ultra with with Manscaped. Manscaped. No, I was going to see. This is something I found on my shelf. It's Halloween. (laughs) I was going to see if there's any scary cryptids. Grant, you want to pull up a list of cryptids for me? (laughs) These are like uh, scary monsters (laughs) about the town. (laughs) This book is not what I thought it was. There's actually no cryptids. (laughs) What is that book? What is it? He just brought a book out. It's a uh, book of eyewitness accounts of cryptids, but there's no, like, names. So <laughs> it just says Short Squatch, but I don't think you could even look that up. <laughs> and I love how the title is, I Know What I Saw. I Know What I Saw. <laughs> I Know What I Saw. What in the fuck is a cryptid? I saw a short squad. <laughs> yeah, what is it? Counters. Like a monster kind of? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> like That's a frog. Foot. That's the Loveland <laughs> frog. Wait, that's <laughs> a book. Frog. That's a book. With, usually that frog has pants on. <laughs> no, he doesn't. No, uh, not the Loveland frog. Frogs don't wear pants. <laughs> no, there's <laughs> the, the, daft? the frog in the toad. The frog in the toad. That's the frog in the toad, isn't it? No, that's the uh, Loveland frog. <laughs> what's the difference between a toad? <laughs> One of them you lick and you get high, and one of them you lick and you've just licked an yeah. animal. That's fucked up. And a toad doesn't like water. I'm ki- I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> you don't live in water. No, a frog you, lives you in water. You didn't sit with that one for very long. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's the Loveland frog he was spotted. I can just give you a quick recap yeah. off the dome. He was yeah. spotted in the early 1970s in Loveland, Ohio. Okay. People were crossing a bridge, saw this giant frog look like a man, and tried to attack the car. They keep driving. Hell yeah. A few weeks later, police officers saw the same damn thing, never to be seen again. Right kidnapped by the cartel. Yeah. So was he carrying a wand? 
or something? Yeah, yeah. Is that on the list? Does it say that? I think there's something about him. Yeah. <laughs> he had a wand. He had a wand. <laughs> and are all three yeah. of these different just how th- how this one looks, or those are three separate things? Different cryptids I'm putting up here. Yeah. Well, if you okay, a- Grant. Well, we're just talking about the <laughs> fucking love to- frog right now. If, so when was the last time it was seen? Uh, I yeah, think it was in the 70s. That's the Mongolian death worm. Oh, dude. <laughs> yeah, but if the frog <laughs> had a wand. It is, I know. All of it. I want to eat, like, <laughs> chocolate ritz with the frog. <laughs> Ooh, some frog legs. <laughs> some milk slaps. He snatched it from across the room. If the frog had a wand, it could have just been, like, a wizard that got turned into a frog temporarily. That's why we've never seen it again. Mm. True. Mm. What a nightmarish reality that would be. Being not a wizard. Up. That's not adding up. And for accidentally me. turning it's yourself not into a frog. <laughs> <laughs> that doesn't account for the repeat occurrences. <laughs> What's up with the? You, do you, already, you know the stuff? He about just keeps the- getting turned into a frog and accident all the time. He's like, oh, I'm fucked. <laughs> the stuff about the worm? Yeah. Do you know? Do you know yeah. that one? That's the Mongolian death worm. People see it. I think in the Gobi Desert. Am I wrong, Grant? You're correct. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Hell yeah. I know a lot of fun facts about cryptids. Those are tremors. <laughs> uh, people yeah. see him like spitting blood or poison in the Gobi Desert. He hasn't been seen in decades, so he probably got dried up down there. Yeah. Just, yeah, it gets hot in the Gobi. Not enough food. He can't digest them in his enzymes. Mm. <laughs> 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 what, what are these other ones? Who's that big beef boy down there, Grant? Who's that bastard? Big, uh, oh, just Bigfoot. Nice. That's just a oh, nice. Bigfoot. Jersey, yeah. Devil well, Jersey Devil up there. Jersey Devil. The that one's scary Look, What's the deal with the Jersey Devil? That's Snooky. Dude. That's Snooky. <laughs> <laughs> well, otherwise known as the bastard son of a thousand maniacs, the Jersey Devil <laughs> was... Uh, <laughs> He was, I think, uh, he was, the legend is that he was born in like a woman's womb and then he flew out into the... What is the like out of the those woods, Grant? <laughs> <laughs> that he's been <laughs> um, out of the womb. Did he, he, he was the pine barrens? Yeah, like, the pine barrens. The... You're like, my God, <laughs> is this is the mom still alive? <laughs> she probably passed, unless yeah. it was a C-section. Yeah. That's the Mothman, of course, right below me. Mothman. Point Pleasant. Recently, people have been seeing the Mothman in Chicago. He's making a comeback. People, that's think so bad. sick. I know. Hell yeah. He was big in the 1966 before the crash of the Point Pleasant Bridge, the biggest bridge disaster in U.S. history, as many of you know. (laughs) As none none of us know. (laughs) I I know Mothman. I like Mothman. He's Uh, the best one. He's sick. What? Dude, Mothman goes to O Block. That would be so sick, dude. (laughs) (laughs) Mothman and Chief Keith. Yeah, dude. (laughs) There'll be like a whole YouTube documentary about it. It'd be awesome. Traveler Ross. Yeah. 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 Shout out Traveler Ross. (laughs) <laughs> is that the English guy? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Dude, we, we are watching those all the time and Swamp Stories. We watch those yeah. a lot too. I'm new to I'm completely new to this. He's turned me on. He's turned yeah. me on to the black culture <laughs> 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 of watching these fucking gangster documentaries. And once one's on, I can't stop watching it. Dude, That's I watched funny. like a five hour couple. one the other day. On King Vaughn? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that one. Yeah. I'm about to subscribe to his Patreon, dude. <laughs> nice. You're deep in it. Yeah, I'm so deep, dude. There's it's, a good subreddit, Shyrakology. Okay. I'm yeah. on that a healthy amount. Same type of thing. Like just all yes. the lore of all the gangsters. Yeah. I'll it's also it's all interesting, man. That's crazy. All the comings and goings. Oh, is that O Block? What's that? <laughs> it's my boys from O Block. <laughs> yeah. It's O Block. What's on the top right? Is that Lessie? What's that called? It's up here? Yeah. yeah. What is that? Uh, it's uh, water dog. Yeah, the water hound. Do- yeah. Dobar Chu. <laughs> water hound. King Dobar. Otter. <laughs> King Otter. It's an Irish thing. Yeah, people think he like he's in the lakes around there. Snatch little kids at night. He cries like a little baby and snatch the kids. People in you know, tails all this time. <laughs> Do you know I about the anteater? <laughs> the anteater? <laughs> the one down here by you? Holy shit. I've never heard tell of that bastard. <laughs> Whoever could that be, Grant? Uh, Cape Lobo. From Brazil, must be a new one. Oh, are you putting these upgrade and new testing Casey? <laughs> testing my knowledge. I was not. He was just. He just knows about them all. Test your might. <laughs> well, have you heard of these cryptids? <laughs> the Oblock. The Oblock. Oblock Eight. Yeah, <laughs> those uh, <laughs> pretty cool. Crypt. Yeah, crypt. Let's go by crypt. <laughs> 
That's pretty cool. Yeah, what's, I watch that trap stuff sometimes. What's the anteater do? Just eat people? People eater? Yeah, that exists. Anteater is real. It's <laughs> 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 not a real animal. Bluff. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, anteater is real. Uh, it's got a lot of hair in its body and runs through forests near human settlements and <laughs> hunts newborn puppies and kittens. Hell yeah, it does. Dude. <laughs> oh, so people are safe. That's not that bad. It will kill humans by squeezing them and drinking their blood and eating their brains if given the opportunity. Squeezing uh, them? Uh, yeah, just, like, hugs you? <laughs> oh, that's a cute animal. You want a hug? The only way to defeat <laughs> it is by shooting it in the navel, apparently. What? In the navel? Why not the brain? <laughs> Shoot it in the belly? That's where the brain is. That's where the ants sleep. <laughs> yeah, I was like, what's a navel? <laughs> <laughs> That's why I trust my gut. Yeah. <laughs> trust your navel. That's a fun one. Yeah. William, imagine seeing one of those running around. I couldn't even imagine. I mean, we have the hearse outside of our apartment now. <laughs> yeah. Luckily, the scary people that were living there are gone. There were these very scary... I don't even know what they were doing, but I sit at home. I play Diablo. I look out the windows. <laughs> There's a hearse fucking parked out front now. I don't know what the deal is with that. It scares me a little bit. These people, they're luckily gone. They were scaring me. I'd stay up at night watching their ass. They were scary. They scared me. And they okay. got kicked out. Yeah. The, you See, you went with like the nicer photo of the anteater before this is a little more scary it's got a great body it's kind of hot it's yeah, yeah. yeah it is honestly kind of hot yeah, if yeah. i was into fucked it fucking cryptids <laughs> this would be a good one yeah yeah that'd be a good, there. This yeah. Is yeah. Be a good one you, you could can. you could cock sleeve the worm though Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> wait what's a cock sleeve that's just when you like that's just like so, <laughs> when you <laughs> Instead of humanizing whatever you're fucking, you turn it into a cock sleeve, and oh. it's just a sleeve for your cock. I thought it was when you go wiener to wiener and put the foreskin over the other wiener. No, uh, I've, I've that's docking. My bad. <laughs> <laughs> docking. That's when docking. you like upload your consciousness to another dude. <laughs> Too much. <laughs> Heard, We're I've, pros I've, now. <laughs> <laughs> uh. Usually, I got that one from. Uh, <laughs> That's great. Someone's about to die, and you just dock with them, and you just get transported. <sighs> oh, okay. Thank you, brother. Thank you. Yeah, I got cock sleeve from porn sets. That's a, a lot of the male porn stars will be. Like, I'm gonna use you as a cock sleeve. Whoa! Oh, then, damn. Grant, you got any more potential cock sleeve uh, <laughs> pictures of <laughs> scary yeah. monsters? <laughs> Look up sexy cryptids, cryptids or something. Yeah. <laughs> it's uh -oh. Halloween, come on. Just sex, sexy cryptids? Well, you can right. see his insides. They have yeah, an uh, anatomy of his yeah. inside stomach. Who made that? <laughs> Does someone know knows that? too much about them. Dude. Like, he has two little lungs down yeah. in his stomach area. Is the brain in the navel? Imagine if he vaped, dude. He would die. <laughs> it would implode. Whoa. Okay. I like the Loch Ness Monster kind of like stinking around. It's cute. <laughs> and look at that one by your head, Zach. That one's in kind of a nasty position. Look at yeah. this. Like Is that that over. Jersey oh. thing? <laughs> yeah, I think so. <laughs> dude. dude, everybody grab a tit. Let's go to town. <laughs> Holy shit. There's enough for each one of us. I need some milk. <laughs> milk slab. Sponsored by Milk Slab. Milk slab. <laughs> <laughs> That's actually how they make Milk Slabs. <laughs> yeah. I had no idea that sexy cryptids was such a thing on here. Oh, it's yeah, huge. Yeah. It has to be. Oh, Sexycryptids.com. <laughs> yeah, <it's definitely laughs> Use promo code Zachass. Yeah, promo code Zachass. Be 50% off com. on a sexy cryptid. <laughs> Pretty oh my cool goodness. to think mm. about. That snake's got <laughs> nice titties. Yeah, <laughs> and it's through two one. boobs up there. What? Uh, what? My <laughs> it started searching. Oh no, that kids. dude! That dude hacked on uh -oh. the all shit. Yeah. Oh, oh, no, 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 dude, he's hacking it. <laughs> oh, oh no! no. <laughs> Where's my daughter? <laughs> Where's my daughter? Dude, we gotta get the Wi-Fi camera, dude. <laughs> yeah, dude, I need that. Where's the dog? <laughs> Where's the dog? <laughs> so scary. All right, so there's the dog the has all the codes in it. <laughs> yeah. <that's> <laughs> <laughs> if the frog looked like that, they wouldn't have been so scared, dude. And this huge area was. I know. Look at those long legs. Damn. Is that at the beach? Play beach ball. Yeah. Dude, 
at the beach. <laughs> on the big island. Oh, <laughs> <man>. Volleyball. <laughs> Volleyball wasn't as good. I, that's all I can say is the big island. The big island. But yeah, we don't know where she's playing. But hard to she, say. Could, she could be anywhere. Yeah, she, could be, she, could be on any, she could be on any of the islands. <laughs> she could. She could just be going to a baseball game. Oh, oh my gosh. And there's a moth man. Moth man. Little moth lady. Moth, moth they, they. Moth they. Yeah, moth they. <laughs> Whoa. Moth them. Moth them. She has fishnets on. Mothy. I can get behind that one. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> Check, please. Very cool. <laughs> Very sexy. Uh, Grant, can you please forward these to our email addresses? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> on it. <laughs> yeah. So what are y'all... It's Halloween. It's Halloween day. It's gonna be Halloween night soon. Are y'all are y'all dressing up? Are y'all saying fuck that? We're not dressing up tonight. What are y'all's plans? What are y'all's thoughts? We're uh, saying fuck that. <laughs> yeah, I I didn't bring a costume. I might uh, like it would be cool to dress up like as something like creepy or something or something funny, but yeah, I don't know. I might just draw tattoos on my face and be Jelly Roll. <laughs> no nice. That could be like that could work. I mean, I'm already sort of dressing like it. <laughs> like, I'm gonna just probably do that. Get in the spirit. Could you? Would you have to get Kenny to draw the things on, or could you draw them? Uh, I mean, I guess if I had a mirror, I probably could. But I think it would be a more fun activity if Kenny did it. <laughs> just draw. You but can't I feel leave that like, up to me. He's gonna get a bunch of dicks on his face. No, that would suck, dude. I, sh- I, I watched some video recently of Promise Casey had stopped watching these, but this guy's overdosing and dies, and they're all drawing like dicks on the guy's Oh face. my God. Well, <laughs> well, I mean, that's probably it's the, horrible. If I'm not going to wake up to be <laughs> yeah. mad about it, I'm. That's go ahead. Yeah, <laughs> like, there used to be like yeah. some website called like Nap Nation or something. What's that? Where like the people would just take pictures of their friends, like passed out. And they would like draw dicks on them, and you would just upload it. That was it. <laughs> Map like, I, Nation. Yeah. <laughs> just taking a nap. Like, trying to aggregate I, I all had the dick multiple dicks. pictures of me just like passed out, all fucked up with That's dicks funny. all over me. Oh, Nap Nation. <laughs> yeah. I thought you were saying Map Nation. No, 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 nap thinking, Nation That's yeah. funny. What does Whoa. that have to do with that? Yeah. Ooh, I, that's a good one. Yeah, I could do that to you, Zach, in permanent marker. Yeah. <laughs> Halloween Hell forever. Yeah. Are you guys doing anything tonight? Yeah, what do you guys got going on? I don't know. Yeah, I figure I might just write damaged on my forehead like the Joker. Hell yeah. And then just go to H-E-B till it closes. <laughs> just walking around. Hell yeah. yeah. Just yeah. walk around, not really buy anything. <laughs> That's... Ask where the chocolate Ritz are. Yeah. You have to yeah. ask them where they are. So. Just walk around the store eating them like, yeah. they're, like they're grapes. And I'll Hell say, yeah. ah, they're too expensive right before it closes and I'll leave. <laughs> walk home six miles. <laughs> 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 Fuck it, Halloween. Get crazy. Take yeah. some Delsum. Yeah, I don't know, would you? I'd take maybe. Delsum with you sometime, maybe. If we could tonight, we could take Delsum. I'll drop them off later. Okay, yeah. <laughs> okay. I just started True Detective Season 1 again, so if you're down to start on Episode 4, yeah, we could take some Delsum, <laughs> and <laughs> you can jump in right in the middle, and yeah, we'll just trip out, watch Rust Cole solve this Carcosa, so that'd be cool. Yeah, I remember that. Yeah, we watched the entire first season of... <laughs> Vice Principals two days ago, which is wonderful. I was laughing so hard at a lot of it. And then the second season, I hadn't seen it in forever. It's not as good. Yeah. It's not as good. (laughs) I don't know why. It's not as good. Is that that Danny McBride show? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. I've seen like the first episode. I've never seen the rest of it. Yeah, Yeah, it was wonderful. I'm still looking forward to watching it, but uh, whatever. It's not as good. It's sad. It's kind of sad that it's not as good because I love the first one and then the second <laughs> one's just not as good and it's like sad. It's fucking yeah. Halloween. We don't have any plans. I was thinking finish off this, but Diablo, Diablo, f- Diablo Four. I know now Diablo is calling my name, but then Eric <coughs> starts getting mad because I'm on it all day. It's <laughs> already gets stressful with the. Th- I'm seeing people in the fucking apartment. I've been seeing shadow people for six months. What level are they? Four or five. Oh, that's not bad. Okay. No, but it's where you Tolerable. can see them. Yeah, you can see them at a four or five. Yeah, but what level are you? <sighs> Shit, seven. Oh, what level okay. are you, Kenny? I haven't started yet. I don't play Diablo. 
That's okay. Notice he's a shadow person in real life. Yeah, I thought we were talking about shadow yeah. people. Hold on. No, I'm a level 65 sorcerer. <laughs> Got yeah. it. Got it. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm not a level 7. <laughs> yeah, you, like, it was a to week re- ago. I knew you would have to, re- to, to correct that. <laughs> <laughs> Scared yet? Have yeah. any of you guys seen a ghost for real? I do want to discuss this really briefly. Have any of you guys seen a ghost uh-huh. for real? No, <clears throat> I haven't actually seen one, but in my childhood home, there was, so, in the shower. <laughs> dude. So. <clears throat> MIT. No, nah, not MIT. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, so, I felt, I was taking a shower one day, and it felt like someone put their hand on my back. Whoa. Weird. <laughs> Super weird. And I was just, like, trying to write it off, like, it's like a shift of wind <laughs> or uh-huh. something, you know? <laughs> and then, like, it happened again. It happened multiple times, but it literally oh, felt like someone put their hand on my back. And then I was just, like, not telling anyone. And then my sister, like, screamed in the shower one day. And I walked in. Like, I didn't walk in. <laughs> no, she, she came out. You peeked out I, of the cupboard. <laughs> What's out. wrong, sis? <laughs> you, 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 took your hand, you took your hand off of her back. Yeah. <laughs> Everything okay? <laughs> I thought you liked this. No, uh, so <laughs> she, I was like, what happened? Why are you screaming? And then she. Because <laughs> my brother is touching my back in the shower. Out, and, and then she can't, then, uh, it happened again, and she can't like she comes out and she she was like, fucking like freaking out, and I was like, what happened? She's like, I felt like someone touched my back. And Whoa! It scared the shit out of me. And uh, did then you I was tell like, her? Oh. Did you then tell I her someone her, was touching you? Then I yeah, then I told her that it felt like someone touched my back, and then, but the thing was, I, I we didn't really know what it was or anything, uh, but. Before all that started happening, I had like burned a Ouija board at my house. Oh no! <laughs> <laughs> and you're not there's like a rules for the Ouija board. Yeah, yeah, you're not. You're supposed to like close it out. Like there's rules of like disposing of it. And like from what I can recall, it's like if you burn a Ouija board without closing it out, like one of two things can happen. Uh, either you'll hear this loud screeching noise, and uh, it will like. You hear this loud screeching noise and you'll die instantly. <laughs> or whatever. Or you'll, you'll sneak in the bathroom and yeah. touch your sister's no, back. That's not what happened, Kenny. <laughs> or fucking uh, it, whatever you were talking to in the Ouija board because you didn't close it out will get attached to you for the rest of your life. Wait, so had oh, you no. been talking to something oh, before so you burned what, it? What happened was my uh, my sister and her friends were playing with this Ouija board and like I grew up like super Christian and they they came back like they started like crying and they're like oh like they, they heard some like demonic scream or something and, really yeah well, they heard Creepy. some noise and they were playing with it and then like they came home and they were all crying and then they told us what happened and then me and my friend were like we're gonna burn this Ouija board and like that's like <laughs> the first thing we thought to do and we go and get it and we we're trying we're pouring gas on it we're pouring all this stuff on it and uh it won't fucking light it won't light at all <laughs> and we it won't light for like a half an hour we're like pouring lighter fluid <laughs> gas everything Weird. then finally it lights and it it really starts on fire and all the embers like form like a face and it just floats away Whoa. are you kidding I'm not kidding at all not well, that's all. scary. Yeah, that was it. Was super fucked up. <laughs> that's really scary. So did y'all? Did it stick with one of y'all? Do you uh, think? Or yeah, that was I, yeah. I found out about that like later. Um, like about the Ouija board thing. Like it all connected Whoa. later for me. But like it makes sense that that could be a thing. Like I, I mean, yeah. Because like I, there wasn't any like the weird like fucking shower ghosts in my house until after that. <laughs> for sure. <laughs> yeah. There's like. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, I, had, I, had, I, had, I had no urges to walk into the bathroom while my sister was showering yeah, until didn't after happen, we burned dude. the Ouija board. But uh, but yeah. <laughs> well, that would scary. scare me. Yeah, that no, sounds was, scary. That's super scary. Damn. Yeah. One time, I went to my buddy's house, and they were all on acid, and my friend was on the porch smoking a cigarette, and he looked really distraught. I said, "What happened?" And he said, "I was looking for a lighter in the couch cushions, and we found a Bible." In the couch, <laughs> and we all got scared, so we burned it. <laughs> oh, <laughs> it's, it's like really scary. It's like, dude, 
like smoking a cigarette like an old man. We're like 15 years old. <laughs> he's like, yeah, I had to burn it. We all thought it was a sign. <laughs> he was like terrified. <laughs> I don't know. I guess he thought it was some celestial thing. <laughs> then when I was, uh, I used to go like, later on I started like going like ghost hunting. Like oh, actually. Cool. And uh, we went to this like abandoned like uh, boys school. Mm -hmm. And it got closed down for some, I don't even really know why, but there's like a like pretty much like a half mile like driveway up to it mm -hmm. and everything's overgrown, but you had to park in like a few neighborhoods over and then you would have to walk up. So, cause if you parked near it, you would get arrested or whatever. And every time we go up there, it would sound like there was this dog like chasing us. Like you can just hear it's like chain collar, just like fucking going behind you. But when we, the first couple of times, we're like, oh, dude, like, there's a dog behind us. We just need to run. We all ran. No one ever looked behind us. Like, yeah. No one ever looked behind. And we were just like, oh, cool. We fucking somehow didn't get, like, bit by the dog. It just went away. <clears throat> and then next time, uh, it was probably, like, three times after that because we went back there a lot to do, like, paranormal investigation shit. <laughs> <laughs> and... Uh, I looked behind me because I was like, dude, this dog's like, we never, none of us have seen the dog. Mm -hmm. So I looked behind me and there's just nothing there. Whoa. <laughs> creepy. Yeah, that was creepy. That is creepy. Damn. Damn. We were in, Ghost we were in Ghost Erica's bedroom in Reseda one time. Why are you shaking your head? This was indisputable ghost evidence. We're laying on her bed one time, <laughs> probably watching Survivor and out of nowhere... She had a, what, some sort of nail polish or something on the ground. I swear to God. It wasn't moving at all. It moved a couple feet across yeah. the floor. Whoa. Oh, fuck. It was dude. weird. How do you explain that, Erica? Yeah, it's in it roll. It just moved. Really? That's so weird. Very creepy. That is very it was creepy. Stop writing stuff. So. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's a freak fest. Wasn't that's pretty there spooky. Wasn't a flashlight that went through my window and there was no one outside? Yeah, I remember that. Yeah. So Who knows? Not right. The yeah. energy in the room just shifted. Dude. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I've never exp I've never had like a fucking paranormal thing like that. Do you believe in ghosts? No, probably because of that. It could be. Maybe you have to believe to see them. I don't know. I don't know. Could happen to any of us. I heard a baby crying in Atlanta. I've talked about it at length. We had a we had a graveyard in our backyard. <laughs> oh, dude! In uh, Atlanta, we lived in a bad part of town. There's a graveyard right beyond our fence, and the only grave you could see was a baby's grave. And I was cooking chicken one time, and I heard a baby crying in the backyard. I just wanted chicken. Dude. Just wanted yeah. a piece. I was cooking baby, and I heard a yeah. chicken crying in the backyard. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Very scary. Well, that's about as haunted as it gets. Yeah, yeah. for sure. On a baby. I hope that baby's doing good on Halloween. Yeah, rest in peace. Don't Me too. Fine. Day of souls. Day of souls. <laughs> day of reckoning. Day of sweets. Day of fun. <laughs> it went from bad to good. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> day of sorrow. Day of happiness. <laughs> Sponsored by Milk Slaps. <laughs> <laughs> and fudge flavored Ritz. Ooh, don't. And raw Try Ritz. It. Don't try it. Try I'm going to tell y'all, don't try them. I, I want to go get them now. Don't do it. I might go get a box after this. No, yeah. Casey, don't. Dude, we're all going to be rushing there to get <laughs> the <laughs> last box. <Yeah. laughs> we're <not> fighting over <laughs> it. <laughs> and that's why, that's why William's like telling us don't do it. Like, yeah, no, he's like, good. there's only a couple boxes yeah. left. <laughs> but you don't want to get into this. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> cool. Well, thank y'all. So much for being on the show today. It was a wonderful Halloween episode. Thank Hell you all yeah. so much. Thank Hell you. Yeah. Thank you for Thank having you. us. Thank you. So funny. Go to uh, <laughs> yeah. Where do y'all plug anything? <laughs> yeah. You go. You go first. Uh yeah. Just uh, follow me on Instagram, Zach S. Uh, go check out my podcast, Maximum Zach. It's on YouTube and all platforms and stuff. Uh, yeah. Hey Kenny, it's Kenny dot com. You can find all my shit there. Me and Zach. Are touring, you know, doing a bunch of dates over the six month, over the next six months or so. Tulsa, Little Rock, Philly, DC, Boston, and Arizona. We're looking, and we're looking for more. So, just cool. come see us live, so we can continue to tour. Okay. Cool. Yeah. Sounds good. 
Thank you guys. So Fuck fun. Yeah. Thank you. Bye. 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 Happy Halloween. Happy Halloween. Ooh. 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 <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for joining us for this week's episode of the William Montgomery Show. Send your questions, artwork, and manifestos to the William Montgomery Show at gmail.com. Leave William a voicemail at 737-471-1098. And never miss an episode of The William Montgomery Show by subscribing to The William Montgomery Show channel on YouTube and anywhere podcasts are sold. Check out William online at william.f.montgomery1 on Instagram. For more William Montgomery, check out Kill Tony on YouTube and check him out live at the Comedy Mothership in Austin, Texas every Monday night. Find more of me, Casey Rocket, at patreon.com slash Casey Rocket. Follow me on Instagram at Casey Rocket. This episode of the William Montgomery Show was recorded at Record ATX Studios right here in the heart of Austin, Texas. The William Montgomery Show is produced by William Montgomery. The anthem is sung by William Montgomery. The drums are sung by William Montgomery. The words are sung by William Montgomery. The William Montgomery Show is a Fanny Co. production. Thanks for joining us. See you next time. Shh, the fuck said that? I'm trying to have fun tonight.